Did you ever use your coffee maker? No, unopened. I will buy it. Guys. Morning. It is Saturday morning. Whitney and I are out hitting garage sales. The kids are at my mom's house. Yep. We, we had a little date night last night. Yes. We had a delicious meal at a place that we have never been before. Yep. So that was kind of cool. Really good steak. He got a, what was it? A volcano cake? Yeah. Chocolate volcano. lava cake or something. <laughs> we went all out. We went all out because we don't get, we don't get out much, honestly. <laughs> um, and then we saw Candyman. Really good movie. But now it's garage sale time. I'm so excited. Let's go find some stuff. Good morning. Morning, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Doing great. great. You've got a good day. Yes. Good Beautiful. You know, we were going to have it last month, and they were predicting like 50% chance of rain, like Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. They work really well. Do they? Yeah. Oh wow. Look at that Alice graphic. Those are yeah. They're wow. um five dollars a piece. I hadn't I didn't okay. want to put the tags on That's until, smart, yeah. That's um, beautiful. Until today, because I didn't want the tags to stick. You know yeah. sometimes the tags will How old is this piece? You know, I I don't really know to be honest with you. Is it meant to have like a candle in it? No, no, it, I, well, I don't think, unless you put like a little tea light, you know, battery operated. Yeah. Tea probably, light. Yeah, probably just like a little tea light. Interesting. Oh, I'm gonna get are, this one, yeah. that these one in are your hand. These a quarter a piece. Okay. I just hate to put the tags on them. Oh yeah, I appreciate yeah. you not doing that. Yeah. I'm gonna look at this underneath yeah, your I mean, stuff, that's okay. I come home and I try to take tags off and it, it rips off. Is this one five two? Yeah. Okay. This is all 21. And I've got 31. This is 15, so that's 46. 53.75? And you got these too, right? Yeah. Yeah. We'll just round up to 54 to make it easy. There you go. Okay. Thank, Thank you, ma'am. Oh, yeah, the right change. Yep. I came prepared. <laughs> yeah. I can't believe I, Like, you have so much more patience for this than I do. I'm like, I Sally like, across the street makes us She still. drives you to it, you know. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now, I can't tell you if it's quality. I did plug it in. Yeah. The, the battery is not charged, definitely. Okay. So I plugged it in, make sure it, it turned on. Beyond that. How much are your weights? Connie. Connie. Connie, get real here. How much are the weights? Oh, $5 for the pair. Sold. I'll leave them there. I'll keep shopping. All the stuff is in there. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I bought it and never, I swear, and used and never used it. Okay. Okay. But if you go to all the pouches, it's got a remote control. It's got all the cable. It gets, the guy, I mean, literally, it hit, take it apart, look at it. You know, it's all there. Okay. What did she put on the price? 15 bucks. Okay. And it, there you go, man. $15. It may work. It may not work. I don't want to tick anybody off. All right. I'm going to take the camera. I don't think that, that yeah, good. that does go to it, yeah. Sony. It, it's all, it, seriously, it was a package I got. Uh-huh. All right, we owe you um, 15 for this, and five is 20, another five is 25, and 50 cents, 25. Connie, yes. make change for this guy. Oh, yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. So what did you get here? So 25, 50 we owe you. Okay. I'm not worried about the 50 cents. Oh, no, I have it. Okay. <laughs> we might need it later. Hold on, wait, I need to get my workout done. Oh, okay, there you go. And carry as much as you want. You got it? Yeah. Thank yeah. you guys. Good luck with the sale. All right, take care now. Thank you. Good luck with the camera. I like to sit on home. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> John? How's it going? Hey, how are you? Good. I was like, dude, it'd be funny if I ran into John. I'm Terry. Terry, nice I'm to meet you. Me too, so. You finding some stuff? Yeah, some. Stuff awesome. Stuff like that. There's Came a lot of sales Texas. today. You yeah. You drove from Texas? Yeah. Oh, wow. Just for the sale? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm heading to New York, so. Oh, yeah? 
Yeah. Do you live in the side of Cincinnati? Where do you? Yeah, live? we're like ten minutes from here. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Well, if you see anything in the pile I want, I have to take it back to Texas. <laughs> okay, I appreciate it. <laughs> Yeah, this is cool. Yeah, that's neat. If they've got these with it too. Yeah, we should buy this. Is it in there? <laughs> nice meeting you, Terry. Uh oh. See, I have to be a little selective in what I take back to Texas. Yeah, you only got so much space. Yeah. Well, keep up the good work. Hey, nice meeting you. Safe travels. All right, thanks. That's really neat. That is neat. Good eye. I totally. Looked past it. What are those? Old records. Is that a Red Riding Hood? Oh my goodness. These are cool. Those are really cool. Those were my childhood records. Were they? Oh yeah, wow. They were my childhood yeah, records. Yeah, and then the, cool. the bigger ones are this. Boy Rogers. Yeah. That is neat. All right, I think we are ready to settle up with you. Okay. We've got seven. Seven. Nine. Nineteen. Perfect. You can give me a 20 and I'm going to give you one back. That'll work. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Have a good day. Thanks you too. For stopping. Good luck with the sale. That's right. Morning. Oh, thank you. That's not for sale. Oh, okay. Sorry. Right here. Morning. Morning. Do you have the Xbox that goes we with the don't. games? No. That's funny. You're the second guy to ask me that. <laughs> I believe it. <laughs> Did you ever use your coffee maker? No, unopened. I will buy it. And my wallet is in the car. <laughs> you might grabbing it. <laughs> there you go. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. How are you this morning? Good. Whoa, that's cool. Board games, three, card games, one. Is this a card game? Would you count that as a card game? It's a more, yeah. Right. More of a recent model, more of an adult type of. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Texting type thing, yeah. We have teenage nephews, so these are perfect. Really bad news. I have these on See the Dyson? I agree. I didn't know it. Is your Dyson for sale? It is. It's five dollars. It's and it it needs a twelve dollar part right now. And I have a new Dyson. Can you get but it? the way mm -hmm. that this one vacuums and pulls everything up beautifully? Yeah, but we've been looking. What part does it need? I forget what it is, right? But it's twelve dollars is what I found out. Okay, <laughs> we'll buy it. It's but the V six. So it's it doesn't last as long, but it's going to be better than what I have. But I have to say it vacuums. But this is what it does. It goes. Mm -hmm. But I just keep going with it, and it vacuums. Even with the without the part. Even? Yes. Oh, okay. Right now, you'd be able to vacuum your. Part. Okay. Okay. Good deal. All right, so we owe you five for that. We've got uh, three for this is eight. Three for that's eleven. How much did you say these were? Uh, one each. That's thirteen. Thirteen fifty. Well, I got fifty. I've got fourteen. Fourteen. There you go. Oh, you're so good. Just you, all you need is that. Yep. Thank you. All right, guys. We are back from the sales. We found a ton of stuff today. I dropped off all my stuff at the shop. I'll show you that later. First, Whitney's going to show you everything she found. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff. <laughs> of the best days I've had. So I got this bread box. I'm going to paint yellow to match our kitchen. John actually got this because he said he played it. Well, he played it as a kid. So. I don't want the kids to play. I think they'll have fun with it. So it's basically like Hungry Hippos, but with a frog. Yeah. And he just like spins around and you just shoot the flies in his mouth. Nice. Got this for $5. Good for one of the uh, rooms. I got three like bird feeders and super cheap too. One dollar, I think this was two. Yep. And this was three dollars. It was brand new. So we have a hummingbird feeder. And this is, we already have one like this and it's awesome. So excited about that. Corn cob pipe. Um, you found this to keep at the house. Yep. Brand new. Um, this is a Melissa and Doug uh, birthday toy. And the kids have something similar 
and they really like it. So for five bucks, I thought it would be nice. John got me this candle. A, uh, what are these called? American Girl, like a little table. Yeah, it's the high off brand chair. high chair. That's what it's called. Yep. It's like we didn't have kids. This is an adorable little fox, like Hallmark type brand, like at the Hallmark stores, like that kind of quality. Nice. Brand new kids shoes for $5. Water bottle for a dollar for Darcy. I don't think anybody cares about my finds. Hair clips. I think they do. I don't know. These uh, brand new games, $1 each. Got some diapers, some socks. And then this whole bag of clothes, and the clothes is actually pretty good quality. She would not budge on the price. It was kind of annoying. Yeah. <laughs> but um, she was doing like $2 a piece because she said that they were really nice. But I mean, some of them were just sleeper pajamas. But anyway, $33 for everything. Yeah, Still, there's close to 20 pieces, I think. In yeah, there. some of it's like really cute. I mean, it's hard to find cute boy clothes. So yeah, and like, like Darcy's gonna love something like that. So I did really good. Oh yeah, and the Dyson. Almost forgot. Dyson for $5, she says it works, but that um, something happens with it. It's a V6, so it's not the best one out there, but um, she said a $12 piece is what we need. Um, when it gets glitchy. So we'll have to figure that out. But I mean, all in for 17 bucks, I'm fine with it. Yeah, you had a great day. I had a great day. He's gonna start totaling me up to see <laughs> yeah. how much. See what the damage is. See what it is, because it, it's it's a lot. It's a lot today. Here's Crosley. You guys don't really get to see him very much. All right, guys, I pulled out everything I found and the garage sales were just absolutely amazing today. So much good stuff. Let's see, I'll start up here. I got a couple of hats. Toy Story 2 for a dollar. Vintage Cincinnati Reds for a dollar. Got this Mr. Coffee Cafe Latte. I actually saw this in a friend's Instagram uh, page. Tracy Parks, you guys might know her. She found one of these used and sold it for like $160, $170, something like that. And when I saw her sell it, I knit, like she had pointed out that it's the latte version that does really well. So I was keeping an eye out for that. And lo and behold, like a week later, I find this one sealed in the box for 15 bucks. Saw a sold comp of this uh, brand new for $349 plus shipping. Got this Longa Burger basket. I tend to stay away from these, honestly. But this was the 2013 inaugural basket. It has some value. Paid $35 for it. And uh, one recently just sold for $99 free shipping. Got an NIV study Bible by uh, Zondervan. That's a good brand of Bibles. I paid $2 for that. Got some jewelry at one sale. I don't do a lot with jewelry, but the price was right. And some of the pieces were just kind of interesting. And I think they're vintage. These are some old uh, cat pins. I think they're too heavy to be earrings. They definitely look like pins. Pretty cool looking though. We've got a bracelet, really neat dragonfly pin or brooch, and another bracelet. Costume jewelry can do well uh, if you know what you're looking for. I don't know what I'm looking for, but I just kind of took a chance. These were all, I think, 50 cents each. At that same sale, Whitney found this Conair Fashion Curl for $3. It's brand new in the box and it's going for about 20 bucks. I picked up this beard trimmer, Philips Dronco Face and Body Pro. It is open, but he never used it. And I saw one sealed sell for 90 plus shipping. So I think I can get 60 or 70 for this one. Picked up a Callaway Steelhead 3 Nine Wood. This club is probably 20, 25 years old. Definitely not modern technology or anything, but because it's Callaway, it still sells. Uh, I saw a recent sold comp of $25 plus shipping. Got some cameras in on sale. I paid 45 for everything in the bag. We've got a Pentex uh, Spotmatic with, I think, a 35 millimeter lens. Is that what that is? 50 millimeter. Then we've got a little Olympus uh, 35 millimeter and some attachments, some extra lenses. I haven't looked anything up yet, but I should do okay with that stuff. Got this killer golf poster at one sale for two bucks. Uh, it's Max Fly True Grit. Let's see, I don't know if there's a year on this thing. 1992. Okay, so we've got Fuzzy Zeller, Fred Couples, there's a young John Daly with a mustache and possibly a mullet. Kind of hard to tell only problem with this is it's got a tiny little dent right there so that might hurt the value couldn't find any sold comps but it was just too cool to pass up got a couple board games at one sale uh they were three dollars each i got franchise it new in the plastic 
and Indiana Jones Monopoly. Not new, but seems to be complete. And I saw a recent sold comp on that for $39.99 plus shipping. I got a griddle at one sale. Uh, it is Cuisinart or Cuisinart, however you pronounce it. I paid $8 for this one. I just sold this exact same griddle maybe a week and a half, two weeks ago for $69.99 plus shipping. So I was all over this. Got a Nikon camera at one sale. It is Coolpix S9700. It's got a nice big screen on the back here. This is just a point and shoot, but it's one of the nicer point and shoots. I paid $25 for it, and I just saw a sole comp of $70 plus shipping. Also got a little Sony Walkman. This is one that would either like clip onto a belt or it's small enough to just put in your pocket. And it only does FM AM. It doesn't do any kind of like tape player or CD player, nothing like that. It was $3, and these typically go for about $25 to $30. Keep an eye out for the Walkman. Got another Sony item on sale. I got a handy cam. This is the uh, little mini DVDs, the little small discs that go in here. Sony handy cams do really well. This one is not as valuable as some. If you find the, they want to say it's like the 8 millimeter tape, those do really well. Those can go like $150, $200. This one I paid $15 for, and it should sell around $90. Got some old kids records on one sale. Gingerbread Boy and Chicken Lickin' for $2. Goldilocks and the Three Bears for 2 bucks. Little Red Riding Hood. And Roy Rogers and Pico's Bill for 5 bucks. Also got this little Sun and Fun Tonka truck for $2 at that sale. Also ran into a viewer at that sale named Terry who was driving to New York from Texas and kind of like shopping at garage sales on his way there so terry it was nice meeting you thanks for saying hi hope you found some cool stuff on your way to new york picked up this brother scan and cuts cm 550 anytime i see brother stuff i always at least look it up they make sewing machines printers they make all kinds of stuff and it always tends to sell pretty well this kind of seems like a cricket machine i don't know if you guys have seen those before i paid 65 for this one and i saw a recent sale of 175 dollars plus shipping got some dumbbells at one sale reebok 12 pounders i paid five for the pair i'll probably just try to flip these locally dumbbells are selling really really high right now and they're kind of hard to find i think i'll probably get 20 25 bucks for those when you found a speak and spell at one sale this is the original from 1984 it has the box has some extra attachments and everything so we paid three for this three for the extra pieces and i just saw a sole comp uh kind of similar with like some extra booklets and cartridges and everything that sold for 50 dollars plus shipping this right here might be my best find of the day this is an old paper mache jack-o-lantern and it is still in really good shape this thing i think is about 75 years old i paid 15 bucks for it and i saw a recent sold comp of 235 dollars plus shipping you guys hear me say it all the time but keep an eye out for the old halloween stuff all right we got to come into the next room for the rest of the stuff i didn't have space to put everything out so i got one big box of cds at one sale he had 25 cents a piece on them and i was like you know would you just give me a deal if i bought them all and he said yeah offered him 10 bucks and he was cool with that there's a good amount of country in here but there's also some rap and r&b and i think that's where the money's going to be with this lot here's some more halloween stuff i got at that first sale of the day this is an old book uh helps and hints for halloween we got one of those uh, like fold out pumpkins, a bunch of little miscellaneous decorations. These were all like a quarter a piece. There's a turkey, black cat, scarecrow, some more Thanksgiving decorations. And I picked up some books there too. I paid up for them, I paid $5 a piece, but they were just too cool to pass up. There's two Halloween ones and Alice's Adventures in Wonderland. Oh, one last thing. I got this old uh, cat plastic candy bucket. Uh, paid 10 bucks for it, but I saw a recent sold comp of $30 plus shipping on that one. That is it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.